I, Jishu Bayaju, nursing lecturer in Biani Group of Colleges, welcomes you all on the behalf of Guru KPO. Today, I am going to deliver a lecture on the topic cardiovascular system. Cardiovascular system is divided into two types, that is circulatory system and the lymphatic system. In circulatory system, it includes heart and the blood vessels and in lymphatic system, it includes lymph nodes and the lymph vessels. Today, we will see about the heart. Heart, it is a hollow muscular organ. It is 10 centimeter long. Its weight is about 325 gram in males and 225 grams in approx females. Now, its position. Its position is, it is present in the mid of the uh, lungs in the thoracic cavity and it is more left to the left than the towards the left than the right. Then its apex is in above and below side and its base in its above side. Now uh, its structure, it is divided into three layers. Uh, that is outer layer is pericardium, middle layer is myocardium, inner layer is endocardium. In interior structure, it is divided into four chambers. That is about two chambers are known as auricles, below one are ventricles. The uh, above two uh, auricles are divided into right atrium and the left atrium and the below ones are right ventricles and the left ventricles. Now, we will see about the uh, circulation. There are two types of circulation which is occurring in our body that is pulmonary circulation and the systemic circulation. First, that superior vena cava and the inferior vena cava which are the two largest veins of our body carry impure blood from all parts of our body and carry it into the right atrium. Then through from right atrium there will be contraction occur and it passes through there is an uh, opening present in between the right atrium and the right ventricle that is known as tricuspid valve and through this tricuspid valve the impure blood which comes into the right atrium transfer into the right ventricles and from there pulmonary artery carries impure blood to the lungs and their exchange of uh, uh, oxygen and carbon dioxide takes place and after get purification blood will again come into the left atrium through the pulmonary vein and from the pul uh, left atrium it transfer into the left ventricles and through left ventricles uh, it goes to iota and iota will transfer all pure blood into the body uh, that's all thank you thank you and thank you for watching my video lecture for more information, you can log on to www.gurukpu.com.